How do you create your life? You get hungry for something, don't you? You decided there's something you wanted so bad that you unleashed all your desire. You became obsessed with it. If it was a business or a car or a relationship or a transformation in your body, if there's something you once envisioned and now it's real, it's because you didn't just envision it, you brought so much emotion to it that now it's in your life. It was once a dream, it was once a goal, and now it's in your life. I can tell you that most people underestimate what total obsessive laser focus really is and what it looks like because you are way more powerful than you know you are if you went crazy, psycho, obsessed, laser focused on anything, even something you're totally ill prepared for. Humans have an unreal capacity to get great at things, even if they don't have a natural talent for it, if they're immersed in it, and to learn something and acquire a ton of knowledge in a short period of time as well. It takes such a desperate, obsessive focus in order to move people in that way, in order to touch people in that way. You really got to focus with all of your fiber and all of your heart and all of your creativity. You want to make your dream come true, you got to stay focused. Some people rather get even than get ahead. Stay focused on where you want to go. You've got to be willing to stay focused, to be creative, to be relentless, because things are going to happen to you when you're working on your dream. Stuff gets better if we work at it and we stay focused on where we're going. Society is conspiring all the time in our culture to completely distract you so you never win. To just divert your focus and attention. Look over here, look at this shiny thing. Look at this TV show, look at this sports team. Worry about what's going on here in this war. And they get these different things on television and our phones and in our lives to just get us distracted so we never get obsessed, we never get laser focused for an extended period of time. Ask yourself truthfully, your big goals and dreams, are you really clear on what they are? Because if you don't have that, we can't even get started. Can you get laser obsessively focused almost to its exclusivity, almost, but for an extended period of time? Can you honestly say you've done that for an extended period? I'm talking about a year, two years, three years, four years, five years, even a decade towards something you want so badly, you want it like oxygen. It's like you want it like you want to eat. You want it like you want to live, right? Are you extendedly laser focused on it or do you get distracted easily? You may take it for granted now, hopefully not, but it was once just a vision. It may have seemed impossible at one time. So how did you do it? You started with a concrete vision of what you wanted and you focused on it continuously, didn't you? Wherever focus goes, energy flows. You envisioned something, you got clear about it, and then you started thinking about all the reasons why you wanted it. You got excited about it. Said, this is what's next for me now. I want this. You may have dreamed about it, thought about it, talked about it. But when you focus on something continuously, something magical happens. You get insights, don't you? You overhear a conversation and you hear something you wouldn't have heard if you didn't have that outcome or goal that you wanted so badly. What I'm telling you is if you really want something bad enough, it's worth it. It's worth it. So start to feed yourself the worth question over and over and over again, not the cost question. Cost is a distraction. Worth is a focus mechanism. This is so worth it. It's so worth it. It's so worth it. Focuses you. Cost distracts you. So I want to challenge you today to make that shift of eliminating these distractions and elevating your level of focus in your life. What's your state? Are you in a state of focus? Are you pumped up? Are you breathing deeply? Are you lasered in on something? Are you completely in there? Or is your state a distracted, diverted state? What I want to remind you of is on the other side of that suffering, on the other side of that sacrifice, on the other side of that laser focus is your dream.